Bum to me, donkey, bite me, three grain of Mothias. No, sir. Moving on, major red flag. <laughs> welcome back to my channel and for those of you who are new here welcome my name is Yannick in this video we'll cover five common red flags oftentimes seen in a relationship but we choose to ignore them even when them plain as day we choose to ignore them for some reason or the other red flag number one the man is emotionally unavailable Oftentimes, we'll know that the man has poor qualities or traits that we wouldn't see ourselves dealing with in the future. But instead of just leaving then and there, we decide, say, let us stick around. Probably he will change. He will change one day. You're wrong. Oftentimes, they don't change. Move on. Flag number two. He wants to tell you what time to get home what to wear which friends to keep and get this he wants to tell you what family member to talk to hello sir are you my daddy Red flag number three feeling insecure in the relationship like certain things that he usually would do for you he doesn't do it anymore he doesn't text you in the morning and tell you sweet nothing he doesn't compliment you let alone you have to compete for his attention He's always hanging out with his friends. Major red flag. Flag number four. He has a hidden past. He doesn't want to discuss anything related to himself nor his family. You have to constantly be snooping. When I'm going to the shower, that's when he take up his phone and try to type in all different type of possible um, password trying to know what's going on. That's too much work. So it must be girlfriend. It must be wife. You must be an investigator, police, all in one. That are too much effort. Next, major red flag number five. He doesn't want to take you out in public. So no KFC and no Burger King. But no, so no, 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 love on the belly. So that I can burn it even more. <laughs> also, he doesn't want to post you on his social media platform. So um, to me, donkey bite me? Three grain of tears? No, sir. Moving on, major red flag. That concludes the five red flag oftentimes seen in our relationship, but we normally ignore them. Now let's get into the mini story time. So when I just came here, I was introduced to a group. So the group had an event and at the event, I saw this guy. He looked nice and everything. He said hi. I said back hi, kept it moving. So later that night, he messaged. So I get my number. So remember, I told you that we all in our group together. So my man looked like him scroll through, find my name, and find my number and message me. So I I spoke with him because at that time I didn't have much friends. So it would be something to pass time. Only to found out that he has a girlfriend. So what well, you are messaging me for, sir, if you have a girlfriend already. That was red flag number one. Next red flag, he stated that he lived with the girl. So sir, why well, you are messaging me if you already have a girlfriend? So his excuse was he's planning to leave her but he doesn't want to leave her so soon because they have assets together that's red flag number two so when i heard all that i said to him okay i'm willing to be a friend nothing more nothing less so he starts saying well i'm planning to leave her um it's just that it's just a matter of time him sorting out his affairs as it relates to the assets and all that so say big man you know forgot you through so much problem me i tell you say <laughs> me only want friendship so that's cool go on and sort out your little relationship issues however he continued to message but i started to ignore it because i realized that he was persistent and it wouldn't be good for me because i don't want to be 
in any entanglement with no man no tree triangle no no square no no farmer shape <laughs> right because me can't bother with the headache so me take time ignore his messages and his invite until but in the back of my mind you know me even said to him say you know a couple of months from now you're gonna propose to her and you're gonna marry to her and him even laugh it off you know but guess what to cut a long story short a couple of months thereafter after me ignore your message and him gradually leave me alone i heard that he proposed to her and they eventually got married but here this now you think him stop this up he's still cheating if you tell me no what type of cross is me that pick up on myself if me they continue to play say i could have changed his mind and i could have been the one to let him settle down not i so i'm glad that i saw the red flags and i listened to my intuition and i left that alone so for those of you females males once you guys see the red flags take heed take heed and move on it's not worth your mental space it's not worth the physical stress it's not worth it leave it alone move on so we have reached to the end of the video thanks for watching guys you like comment share and subscribe also in the comment section please outline two red flags that you have experienced in the past or in the present relationship but you feel to acknowledge it so kindly drop that in the comment section below so guys i'll see you in the next video bye